What well, lads, what's the crack? My name is Orgia Runner, and welcome to Fears of Adam, an episodic indie horror game which you can pick up right now on Steam for free. Well, at least the first episode is free, and the second episode, I think it's about, what, three ninety nine. I think? Three dollars? Four dollars? Whatever. And that's about one euro something, or two euro something in... Well, yeah, two euro something in, in Irish currency, or euro currency, I should say. Either way, a free slash cheap indie horror game and it's based on real stories and by real stories i mean possibly fake stories i'm going to give you an example if you look up a guy on youtube called luna you know what i mean he's constantly apparently giving all these stories about what happened to him when he was a youth all these crazy random stories that are apparently hashtag real but they're not real they're uh, works of fiction for entertainment purposes not that I'm trying to shit on the guy or anything like that, but when people post real stories to Reddit, they're normally real works of fiction. Either way, let's get right into it. First episode is Home Alone. Not based on the Hollywood blockbuster, I would assume. Either way, Fierce of Adam is an episodic psychological horror game where each episode unveils a short story narrated by the ones who survived. You are playing episode 1. More episodes are coming soon. You have... Norwood Hitchhike, which is there, which is the newest one, and there's going to be t three more after that. And I'm assuming they're going to be the same base price of about three dollars or four dollars or hell. I wouldn't even mind paying five dollars for them or even a little more, depending on how this one goes. But let's get right into it. Oh, episode playtime 20 minutes. Fierce the Phantom, episode one, Home Alone, July 12th. July 12th of what year? Every year. I didn't want to put this up on Reddit just for it to be called a piece of fiction. Too late. I don't even know where to start. Excuse my lack of good storytelling skills. I guess I'll just start. Okay. It was the middle of summer. My parents had left for that weekend due to work trip, which meant I was all by myself for the weekend. Also, I feel like I do have to mention that my sleep schedule was really messed up around this time. I would go to sleep and get up at just about any time of the day, though I did plan on fixing that. Okay. Chase, you're home alone and already the burglar alarm is going off. Or is it a burglar alarm? Oh, I can zoom. Zoomies. Whee! Oh, it's a weird ass alarm clock. I woke up at around 8 pm after a nap, after a nap that evening. Okay, right. So, what about that? Okay, and this is our neighborhood, right? No one creeping about my house. No, I didn't think so. Okay, good. Oh, these open automatically, did they? Eh? Still no one? Okay, good. Okay, three texts for Mommy Dearest and Mason Oliver or Oliver Mason. Wait, what the hell I just hear in the background? Wait, when are you guys gonna be back? Dad and I are gonna be back on Monday, honey. Didn't I just tell you that yesterday? Cool. Take care, honey. Sleep on time. I hope you'll get that Xbox like you promised. I mean, if you get that discount. Can I invite Mason and Josh over for the night? For homework? Of course you can. Call me if you need anything. Make sure to check it's them on the door before opening it. Check through the blinds. Take care, honey. Sure thing, Mom. Dad and I may be back by Sunday evening. Why are you being so paranoid? Mom, I'm 14. Yeah, Mom, he's 14. He's a strong, independent... Boy? Girl, I think. I'm going to assume boy. I think I'm going to take a little nap. Probably gonna get, order some pizza. 
That's the job. No need to order anything. Already made you lasagna this morning. Check the fridge. Ah, oh, thanks. Except I don't really like lasagna myself. Yo, yo. You coming to Jessica's tomorrow? Yeah, heard Josh was coming too. What about you? I don't know. What's wrong? Weren't you going to see her yesterday? She didn't show up. It's like I don't even matter to her. You matter. Unless you multiply yourself by the speed of light squared, then you're energy. I guess I'm energy then. How's Kim? Yeah, crap, totally forgot. Probably going to do it tonight. Long, same. My parents are out for the night. Want to come over? We can play Mario Kart too. I'll let you know. Okay, call Josh too. I can't promise, dude. May have plans with Nat. Whoever Nat is, whenever Nat is at home, I'm assuming she is a girlfriend. Maybe. Excuse the hell out of me. What the hell am I hearing? I'm hearing all kinds of different noises here. And then don't ask me why, but... Uh, I took my... What? Let, let what? And I can't even turn on the lights. And I'm hearing lots of background noise. Hey! Hey, we have a creeper! We have a creeper. We have a creeper. I'm going downstairs. Gonna hunt his ass. Hey! Where you go? Yeah, that's right. You better run. Get off my damn lawn! Okay, but seriously, though. Is that the foe we're up against? Is that the creepy guy who's gonna do God knows what? Is he gonna stab me in the butt? Who knows? Uh, right, so we have to get lasagna, do we? Aha, here it is. And uh, food was cold. Toss in the oven, wait for the heat. And I'll see if I can do a quick perimeter check to make sure he ain't coming back anytime soon. No, no, don't see him out there. Okay, we've got the sitting room here, that's good. We've got a large screen TV. God, that's huge. Any brand I know? Fuss TV. Whatever Fuss is when Fuss is at home. Alright. Okay, that's the back door. Take a dip in the pool, maybe? Nice. No sound effects or no water effects. Just the way I like it. Okay, but seriously. Close that door. Open this. No way of locking it. So that's how we're going to meet our doom. By failing to lock the door. Food was nice and hot. I liked watching TV while eating. Okay, so we'll do that. Let's go boop. And see what's on the old tube. Whatever the hell that is. Okay, pop a squat. Start numbing, I guess. Nom 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 <gasps> Oh, I saw you, creeper. I saw you go up those stairs. And I don't really like the sound effect of the eating. That's just gross. I was already feeling very sleepy. Okay, right, then time to go to bed. I can't move. Oh, there we go. Okay, I gotta turn that off because that's creeping me the hell out. Mason Oliver, two text messages. Oh, I don't remember leaving that open. I mean, I left it unlocked, but I don't remember leaving it open. Cheat crow, so I'm already in big doo doo. Okay, uh, we're gonna have to call it off, man. Something just came up, but you gotta come to Jessica tomorrow. Okay, right. Thanks, bro. Thanks for leaving me alone in my own house. I'm probably gonna die. Uh, getting in my car and driving off would be the best possible solution, wouldn't it? But that's probably not gonna happen. We don't do smart things in this game. Okay. No one creeping up there. 
but is he actively or he or she is he are they going to be actively pursuing me around the house that is the thing jesus that door opened quite violently Quiet blinds. Like, is he going to be waiting for me up here? Like, am I? Am I actually slipping down the stairs? I am slipping down the freaking stairs. This guy can't climb for shit. I'm sorry, Miles. Got to go see you tomorrow. I don't remember opening this door. Make sure he's not hiding in here. I don't think so. Oh, that's creepy. There's only one more place this dude can be. Better not be on that door, that's for damn sure. My room, probably. Clear. Left hand clear, right hand clear. Lock the door behind me. Very smart move. Pop a squ uh, squat here. Make sure everything's clear. And I'm leaving that off. That's creepy. Hello, Mr. Killer. You're not hiding in here, are you? No. Alright, then. Guess he must have fucked off somewhere else then. I, I just do homework. Twelve thirty-eight a.m. Oh, huh. now I did homework. Okay, so I must be done. Twelve thirty-eight a.m. That is the brightest twelve thirty-eight a.m. sky I've ever seen. Get two text two text messages from Mama. Okay, don't stay up too late, you kids. I shouldn't get to hear from Miss Paula this time. Okay, 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 all right. Mothers, what would you do without them? So what, bedtime now? So far not really that scary 1 16 a.m i got up to get some water okay so we gotta get some water ah right so this is where the scares are going to begin what's that ticking probably a clock i assume Oh, so creepy. Someone outside, I don't think. That Jesus Christ, some playing drums or something. Okay. No one's creeping outside, but I'm not worried about what's outside. <laughs> Fucking Jesus Christ, those sound effects. Okay, got enough water, buddy? Good. I probably should have closed the refrigerator's door. Okay, yeah, yeah, probably should do that. And so I did. Hello? But did I not turn this off? DDR margin, RFC junior margin, I have no idea what this is. But I'll just leave it on just in case. Should I check these doors? Hello? Oh, 
That was quiet. One's quiet here as well. Okay. That's good. What about out here? Yes, no. <laughs> And then immediately freaking closed. Um, right. I'm guessing I wasn't supposed to do that. Probably wasn't. <laughs> um, all right. I'll try that again. There's probably multiple endings. Now it's probably a bad ending. <laughs> okay, that got me good. That got me good. All right. Ah, okay, here we are back up in the room again and got a lot of texts. Miles? Who's that at the door? You there? Oh, we can actually text back. Help! Oh, we can't, can we? Yes, Queen. Okay, now we can only type a yes, no reply, I think. What? OMG. Or. OMG. Who that? Okay, I can't type any responses for some reason. But I should look out the door, or I can from this area. Shoot. Oh, I can hide. Does that mean he's here? I gotta turn up the volume a small bit because I can't hear a damn thing. So click the hide. I'm just I'm I'm hiding. There's gotta be a way I can send a text. Why is he often there when I when I can't send? Or I mean why is he often for text here? If I don't have the abilities to send unless of course there's only certain things I can say or there is supposed to be a particular thing I can say and I'm supposed to just get it? Call the, call the cops, no. I mean, is any of this relevant to my situation? Was that me? Oh, wait, that's my footsteps, so. Okay. Hello. Turn on the lights, perhaps? No. But what am I supposed to be doing? Like, is he actively pursuing me? Is he in the house now? Close that behind me. Can't hide her in this bed, no. Turn on the TV. Nope, can't do that either. I mean, it's so freaking dark, you can't see a damn thing either. Why 
hear my heartbeat. That's so creepy. What does that even indicate? Like, is it just supposed to show my fear or what? Or is it an indication of where he is? No, I think it's just some bullshit sound effect. 4 text messages from mom. Paula sent me, said he's been creeping through, through the what? We're calling the cops. You kids lock every door and hide in your whatever. Don't answer the door no matter what he does. Okay. <gasps> oh! As I tried peeking through the blinds, he looked straight at me. I felt my heart skip a beat. So what now? Look back and he was gone. There he was, gone. Okay, so there are certain sequence of, of events I have to follow. What, do I just hide now? I mean, that seems like the most obvious thing to do, or will it give me the option to lock the door? I don't know what to do. Just do the old uh, hiding technique again and wait. No, leave that off. I could be dead wrong in doing this. It's Paula at the door. <gasps> hey, creepo, how you doing? Freaking Freddy Krueger. Same outcome. Okay, so there's got to be a way I can avoid that, and that's probably just by waiting it out. Okay, back here again, not sure what to do. Whether or not we make a run for it or not, or just wait for her to call the cops, maybe. Maybe that's the right play. Because we're sure as hell not going to outrun him. That's a try hiding again. Oh! We have Ninos. Oh boy, you want to get it. A game by rail. Oh, I survived. What if I opened the door? And now you're in here. Oh, you must have fogged out the window. Okay. <laughs> but that music, that's unexpected. Hello! Hey, Paula, how you doing? Yeah. Long time no see. Ah. 
Ah, back to the desktop again. Okay, that was fairly abrupt. Uh, right. My thoughts wasn't really that scary. I mean, I suppose I did get jump scared twice. But there was no real threat. It was all sequenced. It was... What's the term I'm looking for? There's a term that I've heard several times during my course of watching Let's Plays that other people have used, but I forget what it is. It's not sequenced, but these are all not pre-rendered. What is the term? And you're not in any real danger because they're all scripted is the term I'm using. Yet, yeah, or I want to use. Yeah, scripted. So scripted jump scares and uh, scripted sequences. Yeah. So you weren't in any real danger. The, the AI wasn't chasing you. There was really no AI there. It was just like a point and click go from a a to b progress on to the next part if you complete the game too early that's an immediate game over you're dead you're done that's it that's the bad ending if you go through all the sequences from start to finish you get the good ending i mean that's a good way of doing it i suppose i mean especially when it comes to storytelling games like this but i know lack of not being chased, lack of there being any danger. It was kind of a letdown in that sense, but it wasn't that bad. I mean, it was. It's a what? It's a free indie horror game. I not expecting AAA jump scares, but I thought there would have been a bit more of a scary ambience. I mean, it was kind of scary at some points, especially the music during my first playthrough, but. As I was going through it two or three times just to get this good ending, I didn't feel in danger. There was nothing to be afraid of, so... Ugh, yeah. But all in all, one dollar game, free game. Oh, yeah, it's a free game, so it's uh, basic free entertainment for me, free entertainment for you if you are entertained by this video. Speaking of which, that being said, guys, you know what to do. If you did enjoy this video, be sure to give it a massive thumbs up, comment, favorite, share, and of course, like always, I will see you guys in the next one. So, until next time, see ya.